What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Lamont Tyson. I'm here with my number one strongest female client, Ellen. And Ellen, I just want to show the people some of the transitions you have been through. Ellen, at one point in time, looked like this. And now she's this lean, mean fighting machine you see here today. So Ellen, what made you choose me to help you reach your fitness goals? Um, well, I spent about two and a half, three years losing approximately 80 pounds. Mm -hmm. um, and I've kind of hit a plateau. Right. Mostly because the primary exercise I've been doing in that three, two and a half, three years has been running. Right. Which is great for a lot of things, but it's not going to get you tone and... It's not going to make you very strong, especially your upper body uh, and whatnot. And I've known Lamont for a while, so I thought now that he's kind of getting more into personal training and stuff, that he might be able to help me reach more of my goals to have more upper body strength, right. have more, have a more toned body, hopefully, mm -hmm. get rid of some of the extra um, stuff that gotcha. comes with losing a lot of weight over a so really have you, short period of time. Have you so. enjoyed the training so far? I have. <laughs> Hasn't been too intense yet? Sometimes it's intense, but sometimes I, I know I need it. Right. So and I'm not afraid of I'm not afraid of uh, pushing myself to where I don't feel like I can do it anymore. Gotcha. But that's because I've spent the last three years doing it. I got a special treat for you today. Okay. Candidate Donald Trump is in the building. Oh, man, F that guy. <laughs> <laughs> well, having said that guy, we're going to go ahead and jump into the workout, let you see what Ellen is working with. Shouts out to my homegirl, Ellen, for entrusting her fitness goals with life gains and me. I'm so proud of her and all the hard work she's already accomplished. First on her exercise regimen today and her training, we had her do three sets of 12 squats and as you can see she can get low with her squat she's in the bucket and this was her first set we did turn up the heat with the weight but i wanted to make sure that she was feeling good today and got a form right and she did and y'all y'all watch out for this young lady she is a beast and she is really hungry and she's going to get to her goals real soon watch Next compound movement I had her doing was the chest press. And as you can see, she comes down to a chest touch and go. Nice and easy warm up for her. Not too big of a deal. She felt really good this day. Mind you, this woman had just ran 11 miles the day before. She makes no excuses. She's gonna get this job done. And uh, she don't want a candidate Donald Trump as president. Let's just put that out there. Next is her pull-ups. When she first came to me, we had to assist her with about 115 pounds on the pull-up. She is now down to only an assist of 85 pounds in not that long of a period. She is well on her way. There is a pretty good athlete inside of Ellen, and she is letting it all come unhinged now. Look at those great pull-ups she's doing. Pulling to the top, she's squeezing and contracting her back doing an excellent job. I had her get about three sets of 10 to 12 on this, and she makes gains on this each and every week. Next up on deck, I had her work in her lower back. As you can see, she extends all the way down and comes all the way up. On the last set of this, I threw some weight on her, and boy, I got cussed out from that, but you know what? She got through and she did well with it. I like having my clients do this a couple of weeks before I start throwing them through abs. You know, you can hit your abs just by sitting upright, sucking them in nice and tight kind of difficult to hit your lower back so this is a good exercise to hit that lower back helps with your posture and is really really good about helping you sit and stand upright throughout the day hit this for about three sets of ten next we work on her abs now would you believe she didn't think she could do this 
she is doing a lower ab exercise just a, just a simple leg raise and once you get too tired where you can't raise your leg and straighten them out all you do is finish by dropping and raising your knees which is what she's getting ready to do right now I had to do three sets of 15 and when she reached the point she couldn't keep her leg straight I just had to do knee raises really really good for the lower abs using your body weight Next, we go to shoulder presses, another good compound movement. And she's pretty beast on this exercise. I had her do three sets of 10 to 12. And in about three weeks, this young lady has jumped probably about 30 pounds. Like I said, there's an athlete in there. Look at that uh, upper front of her chest and the upper front of her shoulders growing. I had to jump in there and help her on that one. And um, she's beasting. Next, I had her get in some curls for the girls. I think this is her favorite exercise. She's working on those humongous cannons, getting them right. This one, we went for three sets of 10 to 12, and she made some really, really big gains in this as well. Look at the form under control, nice and squeezed at the top. And I uh, was starting to get a little heavy to her. Ellen smiles when the weight is too intense for her. She doesn't grunt or frown, she smiles. Last but definitely not least is we did some tricep push downs and this was really, really intense for her. We had gone through pretty much total body that day and she was burnt. Three sets of 10 reps on this we did. All right, we're doing the post-workout talk, one of the most important parts. And so Ellen, how do you feel after this workout today? Pretty much dead. Oh Lord. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like jelly, I could use a nap. Was it intense for you? Rather, yes. Getting on your goals? Yes. So what barriers are you going to face this week that could hinder your fitness goals so we can talk about them? Hopefully not too many. Um, nothing's really messing up the schedule. Yeah. Um, workout schedule is going to be pretty on. Uh, it'll really just be making sure I get the protein that you said right. and the calories. Right. So there not going to be any work stress, anything like that? Shouldn't be too much, no. No household stress. <laughs> You good? No household stress, no unexpected guests. <laughs> the only stress you're going to have is the political stress of Donald Trump becoming our next president. Yeah, that'll be the worst stress. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, guys, that is it. That was Ellen's intense workout for the day. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. Go get yourself a life game. Follow this young lady. She's on a curve. She's going she's gonna to be ripped real soon, y'all. Check Oops. her out. <laughs>